All right, what's going on dudes and welcome back to another episode of ultra modded survival So from this point on I just have to bring the telepad register wherever I go because I forgot to bring it in when I placed down this telepad initially and so when I stood on it just a few minutes ago trying to get back to the overworld it brought up Current location only as opposed to Carrie's castle and Jerry's tree, so I had to go back into the overworld the old-fashioned way and fetch our telepad register, and we're good to go now, so we can get back and forth pretty easily. I just have to remember to bring it with me now wherever we go, but should be easy enough. There we are, back home. Super simple. So I realize I might actually not want to have the chunk loader going all the time because our ME system over here, we have it using fuel, in order to, to stay powered and as long as these chunks are loaded it's going to be using fuel to to keep it powered so it's just going to drain it when it doesn't actually need to be getting drained so until we get a, a better more sustainable energy source from thermal expansion i may actually keep the chunks unloaded while we're going and exploring because let's be honest we're not exactly like hurting in the in the resource department at the moment aside from gold and iron but Let's be honest, there probably isn't that much more with that quarry location. So, any hoosers, um, let's take this out just for now. Don't worry if it seems like it's a, a good thing to have, which it is, obviously, but, but once we have a more sustainable energy source there, then we'll, then we'll place it back. But I think the quarry has also run out of fuel at the moment as well. So let me run over and see if we should keep it powered. Actually, no, we're going to explore... So um, let's, let's, uh, let's leave it unloaded for now. So I'm going to take this out. And then, all right, so I handed, I handed Cherry a diamond to stay put while I was fixing the telepad. But now, are you ready to go on another adventure into another dimension? Let's do it. We're going to try to find a rainbow ant. I think that's like the next step up as far as the Orspawn dimensions go. Let me toss that in there. And I'm going to hand you a sword. I guess I'll keep the diamond on me in case... I need you to, to stay still. Oh, you... Oh, she loves me because I gave her a sword again somehow. I don't know why that happened. Anyway, okay. So, follow me. And we will go back into the forest. And I'm hoping you'll teleport as soon as I get close to the ground. Uh-huh, one sec. And are you going to teleport after me? Come on, where are you? Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Did I go too far? I <laughs> need to... Oh, there you go. All right, cool. So, it looks like as long as I... Doesn't matter how far I go, as long as I touch the ground, then she will follow. All right, cool. Well, let's try to find a rainbow ant. The uh, the ones who are attacking me over by the Tropicraft portal, they're unstable ants, I think, and apparently that dimension is real, real gnarly. Uh, so we'll start here. This one has like these robots and stuff. So yeah, you ready to, to fight some robots? Because it should be pretty awesome. I hope you don't die, because that would be a bummer, wouldn't it? And bikini time. All right, I know, I know I saw some rainbow ants in here. Uh, whoa, just uh, went flying pretty quickly there. So let me see. I think, um, I, also, I also realized I had particles turned to minimum and uh, I just upped them so now we can see particles again. So let me, I'm gonna search around, try to find a rainbow ant. Cherry will, will attempt to help me here. And then when I find one, I will resume. So I found a rainbow ant nest and Houston, we have rainbows. I was standing there for a few seconds and nothing was happening and all of a sudden a whole bunch spawned and we're good to go. All right, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Hey, come back here. I need your rainbows. No, where did they just go? There was just a bunch of them. Okay, there we are. All right, Cherry, are you ready to teleport into the rainbow ant dimension? Let's do it. Whee! I hope she follows me. I hope it was just an issue with Tropicraft and that she'll actually join me in the other dimensions. Yeah, what's up? Okay, you're here. Awesome. And chunks. Chunks, do your thing. There we go. Much better, much better. So this is the village dimension. I guess there are a bunch of villages that we might be able to, to loot and stuff. But at night, we have to be very, very careful. Because there are giant robots that are going to try to kill us. Which is probably not good. Uh, but we'll have to fight them. Excuse me, Spider, what are you doing? The voiceover lines are the most ridiculous, I swear. They really are. Okay, so lots of villages for us to loot. Nope, no chests in there. Eh, hey, Cherry, it's cool. It's cool. Just hang on out. Okay, those are robots. Yikes. Oh, my God. We got to be careful. All the villagers are... I wonder if the villagers are... Oh, 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 oh. You might have some competition here, uh, Cherry. You, they're... What? What are the particles? What's going on? 
I'm oh god. Were those the were the particle effects caused by just lots of girlfriends and lots of robots and lots of villagers? What is this dimension? What's happening? I'm so confused. Why are there so many fireworks going off? Is this what happens at night? Are you all celebrating? What? Oh, ow! 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 Yeah, take him out! Oh, wow, you just did some serious damage. Holy crap, she did 17 damage. That's legit. Are all, oh, they're little, like, rocket cannon Madu hickers that just... Oh, man, jeez, just rocking face. Oh, jeez. Get wrecked. I can turn into a rolling robot thing now. Um... Oh god, everything is blowing up, and what? how am I getting redstone blocks? Oh, from these dudes. Oh my god. Yeah, get wrecked, everyone. Oh, I'm on fire. Maybe I should turn into a blaze man. Hold on, let me just quickly turn into a blaze. Yikes, and boom. All right. Careful. Careful, Cherry. Careful. Oh god, she's going to die. She's actually going to die. That's not good. Nope, nope. You get oh god. Cherry, 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 be careful. Okay, so the game just crashed. Ke ja ja Cherry, Cherry, careful. You have eight health. Stop. Stop fighting these things. They're really dangerous. Just, just stop. Stop, 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 stop fighting them. I'm gonna give you a diamond so you can just chill. 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 Just chill. Just chill. Just chill. Jesus. This is ridiculous. I'm now Blaze Man, but okay. All right. All right. I'm hoping that... Ow. Ow, 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 No. She died. Oh, no. Oh, no. We lost our girlfriend. Cherry's gone. Oh, no. Oh, no. What? Oh, no. My love is... is oh, no. But more importantly, my diamond is gone. Oh, man. I really liked that diamond. It was a, it was a good diamond. And now it's not here anymore. And that makes me sad. All right. Well, I would say that this... Oh god, what's what's this? Is this what happens when a girlfriend dies? Oh, that's why I turned off particles because it's really obnoxious being a blaze man. Forgot about that. <laughs> oh jeez, hold on. Let me let me let me put an end to this real quick. It's like why am I smoking? Oh, that's right. This is why I turned off particles in the first place. Uh, let me go back to being a bat real quick. I know the vantage point is not ideal, but I do want to be able to fly. Oh my god. So is this what a girlfriend drops when these high heels? How much damage do the high... Jesus! Can you get... Uh, how much damage do you do? Not too much, apparently. You just have a bunch of health. Yikes. One sec. And the zombies, like... Oh my god, how does anything survive in this dimension? Raspberry. I got raspberries. I mean, that's cool. I got boots, and I got slippers, and I got high heels. What do I do with this? Do I put them on? Nope. Can't do that. Uh, do they do damage? Do they? I'm sorry, villagers. I would save you, but I, I think it's it's basically like game over right now. It's bad. Why would you choose to? Why would you choose to set up your homes? Why would you choose to set up your homes in this dimension? I mean, look at the carnage. Look at the carnage. Let me. How much damage does this do? Not much. Oh, it does none. That that was regrettable. Um, oh, it's okay. There are plenty of villagers. And oh, are these bombs? Oh, it is. How much damage do you do? I want to be a bob <laughs> Uh So I think all the girlfriends are currently dead, which is unfortunate, including Cherry, who... Uh, R.I.P. I have this magic touch of being able to get everyone killed around me, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is, I guess. Um, I forgot to change the config so that coconut grenades will work. I kind of want to, I really still want to try those. Um, well, anyway, my inventory is spammed. What do robo laser charges do? Robo laser charge. I feel like there's a robo laser gun thing that, let me search robo. Robo. Spawn robo new. Essence of the robo sniper. Oh, this is like an Ars Magica thing that you can fill with any mob essence it looks like. It's not... Not a special or spawn thing. That's funny. Let me toss this out. I'm just, you know. Oh, I shouldn't have thrown out the piston. I need pistons. One sec. Pistons are good. All the pistons. I should actually take out lots of these guys if they drop pistons. Because that's helpful. Um, but things that I don't need include that. I'm going to collect some red flowers as well. Because it's time for us to find a new girlfriend. I move on pretty quickly. Um, just, yeah. <laughs> that's how we do, I guess. You know. 
Oh, oh, and then I can, oh, I'm going to kill all of you. I can get such a huge supply of redstone. Thank you. Actually, let me, I should probably leave them in storage block form so it takes up less space in my inventory. This is the best. This is the best. I'm going to kill everyone here. And just so many redstone supplies, but I don't know about the boots and the slippers and the high heels. All right, this is Redstone Dimension City. Let me just take everyone out. All right, Robo Warrior, you're gonna, ow, 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 ow. These guys hurt. They really hurt, ow. Uh, Robo Gunner. All right, Robo Gunner, get, get wrecked. Done, done, and done zoed. Okay, and I'm gonna try killing one of the Robo Pounders because they must do a lot. They must have a lot to drop, a lot to offer. Uh, no, ba bum bye. Bye, boom. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, one sec. I'm gonna try killing one as me, actually, as opposed to being a bat. This could go real poorly, but it's worth a shot. You know, wouldn't be vacation without taking risks or something like that. Uh, all right, Robo Pounder, are you ready to face my wrath? Probably you are, I would assume, but redstone everywhere. Thank you, redstone, redstone, redstone. Yikes! Oh god, someone's firing projectiles at me. I don't like it. I don't like it. Okay, Robo Pounder, get wrecked. Get ow, 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 it hurts. I'm not actually taking that much damage, which is good. Um, maybe they're, ow, god damn. Their attacks actually aren't that heavy duty, it seems. Ow, god. Is it just all for show, maybe? Get out of here. Not The knockback's helpful. All right, get wrecked. And, oh god. Get, ow, spider, not in the mood. Not, this is not the time. And get owned. Get owned. Get owned. And fighting three at once. You get rooked. Oh. All right. Get out of here. And get out of here. Give me iron. I want your iron. I'm not actually even taking that much damage. Why am I not taking damage? What in, what in the world is going on? I'm like, I must be invincible. I'm actually, hold on. This is awkward. This is awkward. I don't know why I'm invincible. Uh... <laughs> Wait, why am I? I'm literally not taking damage. I'm confused right now. Did something, me did something mess up with the crash? I may have to investigate, because this is weird. Hold on. Um, yeah, that's not right. That's definitely not right. Because I was like, how am I so strong? Um, yeah, give me a sec. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look into this, try to figure out why I'm... Oh, iron everywhere. Ow, stop. I do want the iron. I do want the iron. Let me just get rid of something in my inventory so I can get the iron. Now that I'm invincible, it doesn't really matter. All right, iron, iron, I need lots of iron. Oh, blocks of iron, solid blocks of iron. <gasps> yes, oh, that is just the most helpful, but okay. Anyway, now that I've gotten all that, <laughs> let me look into why I'm currently invincible, apparently. Um, all right. So I went back to the overworld for just a second to test things out, and it turns out I'm not actually invincible. The amethyst armor is just absurdly strong. If I start taking off pieces here, hold on, attack me. Attack me. Okay, I'm not taking any damage. Hold on, now allow me to take off a piece or so. And now I do take damage. It's just this chest plate is unbelievable. <laughs> so, all right. Um, Amethyst chest plate. Thanks for being awesome, I suppose. There we go. Well, anyway, I, I put down a telepad so we can get back and forth pretty easily. I should probably also, um, I should probably also waypoint it. But yeah, for realsies, this is the greatest dimension now because I can just collect iron and redstone and it's the best. Okay, so what should we call this? Um, we'll call it get back home. <laughs> or no, we'll call it telepad. Telepad once again, and uh, we'll color it purple just because that's a good telepad color. And done. Fart noise is gay. I also looked on the uh, the Orspawn website just before starting this episode because I wanted to look up what the dimensions were, and it looks like there's a new update. And you know that tree I was talking about in the brown ant dimension that's like just made of solid diamonds and rubies and uh, not rubies, diamonds, emerald, gold, etc., etc. So. In the, uh, in the effort to, to balance that, the new update adds a boss that's even stronger than Mobzilla that defends that tree. So now you have to beat that boss in order to access the loot. 
So it balances it out a good bit, and now that'll be something uh, worth trying to, to do eventually, but it's even stronger than Mobzilla, so we have a long ways to go before we can do that. But still, pretty cool, you know? Pretty cool. So let's let's collect some more uh, some more resources here. You know why not? Let me uh, let me go back into being regular old me, and I don't even know if there are any more robots around, just because um, it's daytime now. But we'll see. If not, we can always explore the uh, the other. Okay, so th these dudes lead to another dimension as well, and apparently that dimension is just real annoying as well <laughs> and real dangerous. It's called the danger dimension, uh, as far as I know. Unless I'm wrong there. Uh, anyway, okay, so let's see. Let's see if we can find any more robots. No, it looks like they just come out at night. More rainbow ants. All right, well, let's go to a village that hasn't been completely decimated. And maybe we can find a girlfriend as well, and we can take her back home. And what will we call her? Sherry, maybe. Maybe we'll call her Sherry. I can't think of many other airy names that uh, that that we still haven't covered yet. So... Anyway, let's see what we have over here. Any, oh, uh, apple cows? No, I want golden apple cows. Oh, but more bookshelves. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. I just want to complete the aesthetics. Stop, stupid termites turning everything into muck, dirt. I'm sorry, this is for a good cause. Actually, Silk Touch, what am I doing? What am I doing? What am I, stop turning it into, y'all are stupid. Get out, oh my God, there's so many. You're annoying, extremely annoying. Ay, ay, ay. All right, silk touch, please. There we go. Boom. And no, my inventory is completely full. I need some. Uh, I need to get some red flowers, some roses, which are no longer in 1.7. God dang it! Why are there so many of you? Jesus, go away! Go away! Oh my God. Go and there we go. Hopefully we can find uh, another few in a, in another village. But get out of here! This place is turning into dirt. Jeez, these villagers just have it real bad. This is trying to inhabit like Venus or something. It's the equivalent of doing that. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so let's go to let's go to this village over here. Let's see if we can find some more bookshelves. Maybe. Hey, yeah, yeah. It is cool that the the villages in this dimension do generate with all the all the traits that are added from the uh, the different mods that are outside of Orspawn. So that's kind of nice. Anyway, all right, here we go. Let's see if I can find some more bookshelves. Cool, cool. I was wanting I was wanting to find some more bookshelves. Honestly, I, I was debating whether or not I should go and try to find another village, and this solves our issue. Very nice and handily. Um, okay, so where are we? Right here is it this one. Are you the bookshelf master? No, you are not. Uh, where is the bookshelf master? I think it's this one. Right here. Okay, and yeah. All right. Don't mean to bother you. Just going to take all your stuff. Cool? Yeah, it's cool. Not much you can do about it. I'm sorry. You have your arms, like, permanently. Have you ever thought about why their arms are always like that? It's like their hands are sewn together or something. It's, it sounds like kind of a... a gruesome medieval ritual that at, from birth they, they have their hands sewn together and, and that's why they're always ugh, ugh, that's no good. Uh, 13 should be enough to cover our needs to complete the look of the enchantment room. Uh, so that's cool. That's cool. Some uranium in there. Nice little cave. Um, let's see. So we have lots and lots of iron. Oh my god, we have a lot of iron now. This is amazing. Let me just toss out a few things I don't need that I'm probably going to end up collecting again just because of all the explosions that are about to take place when it turns to night. Again, I still don't know what the robot laser charge is, and it's just occupying, like, all of my inventory. So let's toss that. We have cotton seeds already. Raspberry. I kind of want to try eating a raspberry. Let's keep it. <laughs> and then do we want dispensers? Maybe useful for things. Golden apples. Useful. Coconut bomb. Useful. Books. Um, useful as well. Okay. We'll keep what we got. We'll keep what we got. We just need to find uh, some red flowers. Because we need to find a new girlfriend. <laughs> Where are the red flowers? Come on, I see cinnamon plants. I see plenty of yellow flowers. How about the red ones? I probably already passed like a bunch of them, to be honest with you. But uh, no big deal. Where are there like no... In a dimension that was just full of girlfriends, there are no more red flowers. No? Oh, there we go. There we go. 
just harder to find apparently than uh, ye old yellow flowers. By the way, where did where did all the girlfriends go? They aren't here anymore, and I need one. This is important. All right, there we go. Boom. All right, girlfriends, come out. It's mating season. <laughs> yes, Cindy. Oh God, and here come the robots. Uh, well, mm, I think the girlfriends learned their lesson. They're not. They're not gonna come out again at all. So, well, time to collect some resources. Let's kill the uh, the Robo Pounder dudes because they seem to, to yield a pretty good supply. Um, we'll kill a couple more and then we'll probably call it good because I will have plenty of iron, which has been the uh, most needed resource thus far. All right, bob -ombs. come on. Here we go. The only obnoxious part about this is the fact that I thought the knockback was good at first, but now it's just becoming a little bit annoying. Alright, I'm on fire, but it's okay, because Amethyst Armor is the best. Yee, yee. Ow, what am I being? I'm being hit by this stupid thing. Get out of here. Ow, ow, ow. You're being double pounded by robots. That sounded bad. I shouldn't have said that. Okay, there we go. Cool. Cool. And take this dude out, and then we'll call it, we'll call it a day. Okay, I keep crashing because I think there are just so many things going on in this dimension, so many explosions that it's just not working well for for the game. So <laughs> I'm just gonna take this dude out, and then we're gonna we're gonna leave this place forever. Um, there we go. Give me your iron, please. Just gonna grab that real quick, and then now we're on our way. Ah, uh, see you later. <laughs> see you later, dimension. Ow. Ow, okay, we're, we're done. Hold on. Oh, I wanted to try eating the raspberries. One sec. No, creeper, stop saturating. So very saturating. One sec. Uh, let me run. I need to go. Gotta go fast. Gotta go fast. Chunks, help me out here. Help me out here. I love how I take damage from falling, but it's all, it's cool. A giant robot is just pounding his fist onto me from like 30 feet up, and uh, and I don't take damage from that. Amethyst armor, pretty, pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Okay. Um... This is just chaos. One sec, uh, let me grab that and put it back. Okay, one sec, we're almost out, we're almost home free. Please robots, don't blow up my telepad, that would be much appreciated. Be real nice of you to not do that. And let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh boy, we're in the clear, I think. And back to Gary's castle, wow. <laughs> what a vacation that was. Ooh, all right. Well, that out of the way. Um, we still have to find a new girlfriend. Oh, I got cinnamon as well. How cool! Now we can we can finish up the uh, the the cool place. The cool place called it the cool place. It's called the enchantment room. Finish that up. We can even we can put bookshelves on the top as well. Yeah, we have just enough. Unless, actually, no. Here, let's um, let's put some back here. I think. Yeah, let's put a few there, and then we will call it. Good. Boom, boom, boom. And then uh, we'll put some wood on top as well. Just give me one second to grab some of that. I'm going to have a lot of stuff to uh, sort out in my inventory, but should be all good. Let me just throw that in there. And then we will wrap up that. All right, cool. Enchantment area all sorted. Well, anyway, <laughs> that was quite the vacation. So I think I'll wrap up this episode here. Hopefully you've enjoyed. If you have a rating, would be much appreciated. Other than that, thanks for watching. And next time, I don't know, we'll do more stuff and, and things. And yeah, cool.